there, making a real mess of clearing it, Peterborough. Mooney tried to get it in. And they're appealing for handball, I think, but the goalkeeper's the man who's got his hands on it. Resnick tried to get hold of it, Little kept it off the line. There, possibly, it touched his arm. Well, again, teeing up Little this time. Thought he could have hit that first time, but decided not to. It scrapes the post, ultimately. It's from the right-back, Mark Little. Teed up by Rowe. Thought he could have hit it there on the run. Dean Cox for Leighton Orient. The ball does its job. Dean Cox again. This time he's in. At the second time of asking, Dean Cox takes Leighton Orient a step closer to Wembley and maybe the championship. Back in behind Olcott. Got two to pick out in the middle. This could seal it. It's a real chance, and it's there. He's Dagnall. And Leighton Orient are going to Wembley. Here's a chance, and here's a goal back. It's Connor Washington, and maybe there is a chance for Peterborough. Deep into added time, but there is hope now for Peterborough United, and there are nerves all around Brisbane Road. Grant McCann swings it in, and it's headed over. Alcock it was who got his head to it. They were that close to forcing extra time. On an emotional, dramatic night at Brisbane Road, Leighton Orient booked their place in the League One playoff final.